Hi guys, I hope you're having a great weekend. I'm Neil of Back to Gaming. Today we're going to show you how to do your own benchmarks. Like here, uh, benchmarking seems to be very hard, but it's really simple and easy to do. Okay, now we're going to show how we make these graphs out of the Fraps benchmarking beta. Here is the template we use to create our frame rate over time benchmarks along with the frame time data. You don't need to input anything here. All you have to do is copy and paste the frame time data from Fraps and paste it here, columns B, C, and D on this two on test one sheet and test two sheet here are the output files of wraps when you do a benchmark uh, okay let's here it is here this is the frame time data the one I just highlighted you've noticed that it's the value is 59,000 this is because the frame time data output of wraps is in milliseconds if you divide this by 1000 you'll get approximately 60 seconds okay so let's try to copy this On here as you see the frame the frame rate over time data is reflected here already but there's still no graph here because we need three runs for that uh, this is going to be long and boring if I will show you all the steps in copy pasting so I have prepared a file that's already been complete here it is okay now you'll see that the data is complete this you see I also renamed the test one sheet from 4C80 and the test to sheet from 4C to 40. This is to avoid confusion when uh, when the the number of testing you'll you'll be doing is increasing. So it is four cores, eight threads. That is that's the meaning of the 4C80 here. So you see it matches here by the way this uh, this benchmark here of GTX 1070 was done with our old template that's why you will still see minimum frame rate and the frame rate uh, the frame time data is still on a separate uh, chart now to make things simple for our readers uh, we've revised this now we'll show just the average frame rate and the 99th percentile frame time and 95th percentile frame time data and the frame rate graph but as you see it, it matches the 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 old results here 97 average fps and the 15.29 percentile frame data Okay, so there you have it. It's really easy. No need to be no need to download any special program for that. Now for the to create a JPEG file for this. 
We'll just create a screenshot here. So here it is. It's now the JPEG file now. Can can this is the file we post on the website. If you want to use our template, uh, kindly check the download link in the description box below. If you like this video, give us a, th a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel.